hi guys welcome and welcome back to my youtube channel my name is marisa kisaka if you're a new member karibu sana and if you're a returning subscriber hey baby hey boo hey lava welcome and welcome once again um <coughs> this is our episode I think episode four or five of, of our Tuesday talk show, and today I'm very delighted to have my sisters, my friends on board. I let them introduce themselves. Like, <laughs> hi, <laughs> hi. <laughs> you can introduce yourself. Hi guys, my name is Masi Juma uh, on Instagram Nash Juma Zero, and on YouTube Masi Juma Official Two. Yeah, we are happy to be here today. We are excited. She's an artist. My name oh. is Isha. <laughs> yeah, you. Go to Pepper and be your mother. <laughs> you are so nice. Fanya, Fanya, Nita Tenna, Tenna. Mama nice. Nita Fanya, Fanya. It's a blessing to 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 be interviewed or to be in one of your friends' vlogs. Yeah, it's a it's a real blessing. Uh, I am not a social media person, uh, but on Instagram I'm see blessing. So if you wanna check me out, you can just uh, click uh, or search for see blessing on Instagram on Facebook. It's see. Imagine when we go to ten stand, tango, tango. Three days ago, Sina was telling me, "Ebo to join the mass To join the to end up to a cat. See mass one go move. Like we've been through a lot with these guys, yeah. and I'm telling you guys, I've been yearning like all my life, you know. I've been yearning to ask them some questions, and today I want us to talk about uh, <coughs> uh, self-esteem. Matters to do with confidence, you know. The age we are in, I feel like guys um, uh, wanna struggle sana with self-esteem, confidence. Like the, these guys are not confident. Okay, you guys, us guys, we are not confident in one way or another. So. What do you understand by a healthy self-esteem, if I may ask? Sidna Baraka. Dr. Rich will be. If you talk about healthy self-esteem, I think uh, you don't depend on the surrounding to determine your self-esteem. That will be healthy. If you depend on, on, on what people say about your beauty or what, not people say about your confidence or not people basically your surrounding to determine your self-esteem then that won't be healthy because every time you'll be asking yourself questions am i worth it am i beautiful enough am i this or this at the end of the day if you depend on people you'll end up in depression yeah so i think a healthy self-esteem will, will be coming something that is coming from within and for, for those who are believers like us, mm -hmm. uh, we depend on the word of God. Because when God says in Psalms, uh, I am fearfully and wonderfully made. And then I, I was created in his own image and after his own likeness. Then, and also Genesis says that we are made up, uh, in his own image and after his own likeness. And everything I am is determined by God as long as I am saved. Since Christ lives in me, it is no longer I who lives but him. So, as I already said, uh, don't depend on the surrounding to determine your self-esteem. Don't, especially those in high schools and those who are in fresher campuses there. Uh, but on a, you'll get people 
they, they, they depend on what people will say. So if I see you, you go ask someone, how did I do it? How did I do this and this and this and this and this? If I do a presentation and ask my classmates, how did I do this and this and this and this? Mm -hmm. But if we, we listen to the inner voice, because at the end of the day, if we listen to what other people say, there's something that will grow in us. And I'll end up being affected either positively or negatively. Yes, so uh, I'd say a health self-esteem is not, don't depend on the surrounding mm -hmm. to determine your self-esteem. Yes. <laughs> so in addition to what Sidna has said, I also feel like when you have a healthy self-esteem, you also have respect for others. Because I feel like pe people make, okay, how do I put it? Yeah, self-validity. Mm -hmm. plus validity other people you because i feel like people who have low self-esteem they make others feel bad about themselves mm -hmm. so not needing other people's comments to feel comfortable but also respecting how other people's self-esteem yeah. have you ever at any point in your life struggled with self-esteem mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's a daily affair <laughs> How did you handle it? How was it? For me, it was to do with my skin. Mm -hmm. I've talked about that before. Mm -hmm. And also, I, I was not the kind of girl that boys used to mm -hmm. go to when I was young. Mm -hmm. So I, during fun kids, I was the one that was always in the bus studying or reading a set book. Mm -hmm. I was sleeping. I, I never... I was not very social with men. Mm -hmm. So I, I always felt like other people were more beautiful than me. My desk mate in high school, she used to receive letters every weekend and then she would write from different schools. Mm -hmm. I think when I was in form, I was in form four, like I'm a form three. So I used to feel maybe I'm not pretty enough. International school. Hey, everyone had down. long hair, everyone was beautiful, and then there was me. So sad. Hey, even today, somehow, but I feel like when Sidna said, the more you grow your confidence in God, mm -hmm. the more your self esteem grows. But it had been a process even here in campus. Mm -hmm. yeah. oh, that's amazing, amazing, man. Okay. I've, I've, heard, heard. I've, I've had moments from primary school. My skin yeah. wasn't really good, I had really bad acne. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm very bad than the one that you guys have ever seen mm -hmm. in campus. So, uh, boys used to say, uh, in primary school, that I have a mm. Yes, I, I really felt bad. It was so bad, sometimes I used to pray. Because you know when you're in primary, everything yeah. is personal. Serious. Yeah, so when they talk about people <coughs> in class, and then when you learn about that topic, I HIV, and then they say mm. they always have these rashes. So people used to say, I have a HIV. Mm. Yeah, it, and I believed it. Mm -hmm. Yes, I believed I had a child in primary school. Ah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, getting to high school, it wasn't that bad. Mm -hmm. But I think I got some some people who helped me. I've used several products until I gave up. Because I would use after some time, then they come back. Then I use and then I become allergic to the products. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Until now, I go to campus. Not that I'm comfortable with my skin, but I've learned to live with my skin. Mm -hmm. And at least uh, every day through my friends who are here and others, I'm learning to get better. By the way, if you want skincare, <laughs> yeah. yeah. So as Thank in, I, 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 I've learned to take care of my skin, to wash my skin. Sometimes you go to bed at all, Josh, also. Now my kwa kwa vumbi the whole day. So I'm slowly learning to take care of my skin, and I'm seeing several changes. Yeah, I also had esteem issues with my legs. Yes, very much. Yeah, with my legs. So I, I used to think, or I, I, I have, we call them gastrocnemias muscles. Yeah. <laughs> Do you want muscles? Gastrocnemias, that is anatomy. Yeah. So, uh, I don't know, I think there was there was a time up in campus, in high school I didn't have a problem in primary, my legs were just fine. Mm -hmm. So when I go to campus, there's a time I was in a leg dress. Then in the nation. But then I was walking really fast. Then a guy came from behind, someone I know. I could just pin my even because I was walking really fast. I felt bad for sitting one. I was scared to buy. But I could just as in several occasions, I feel eh, 
hadi i didn't see kwanga na vaa mango fupi because i didn't want my legs to be seen i didn't want to wear trousers mm-hmm. kama ni kuvaa longi ni zile officials zenye huko chini zinaweza iko fine eh so that mtu asione miguu yangu but as in ni melan kuji appreciate bila niko because one thing i've come to understand god ali ni pay me good for a reason yeah. eh there are people who desire to have such legs for instance niki wa home there's a guy who doesn't have legs and akwanga bega kwa barabara so every time niki pita hapo niki msalimia anambia tu mungu thank you for these legs as much as people will criticize me and do everything and say everything about my legs i've come to appreciate what god has given me plus my confidence grew through my friends when anambia see that you have cute legs niki hadi nikaanza kuvaa skirts fupi na za trousers and the dress yeah and it was yeah eh as in nimekuja so far as in several of my friends my my mentor ruth mm-hmm. eh, and niambia sina you hide i really like your legs eh, kila saa tu na tano na jidout alafu ni kama bitch hapo na kugonga slab mm-hmm. no na eh as in i've come to 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 to, to, to accept mm-hmm that this is me and this is what god gave me and and that he doesn't make mistakes that's true yeah oh thank you oh. <laughs> i'm blessed <laughs> you guys <laughs> let me tell you i've also struggled with self esteem hey me ni kona mingi i think hata ni ile wana allow zingine tu ni mimi mwenyewe unjipea i'm telling you i used to struggle with communication skills I used to struggle with confidence. I used to struggle with my leg. I can totally relate, you know. But hey, it took me time. And it's still a process. <laughs> the more videos. This is the second video I'm making about self esteem. Yes. Because I want to mimi nataka kutoka kwa hiyo mtego. Honestly, I'm struggling. Let me tell you guys the truth. I'm really really struggling. I'm hoping I'll have another video again to tell you guys how much this too and you guys plus God may change my shango you know mm-hmm. let me ask you how did you tackle you know when people used to like tell you or rather um eh, bully you embarrass you, embarrass you mm-hmm. about your skin mm-hmm. eh? how how did you handle that did it affect you uh, how did you come out of it because eh? nowadays you are knowing this guy is knowing i i think for me i'm mm-hmm. i'm very stubborn eh okay me friends wangu i think mna i i don't just listen and take to heart sometimes kama kwanza unisaidi Unajua mimi ni ule mse wa ukiniambia usivae nguo niambie nivae gani cuz niko poor at decision making so usiniambie tu skin yako haikai vizuri so like eh uh-huh, continue so i think you may need idea pia juu people would laugh at me and remember even my 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 then boyfriend his friends like friends wa my boyfriend wananisengenya eh hey, you never do makeup jay skin yake and hata yako hapo mm-hmm. ako kwa hiyo conversation you can imagine so i think for me i just told myself then let me find my own solution mm-hmm. so nili nili make a lot of mistakes along the way aki ni dues pesa sasa ni kikumbuka na pesa ni dues your time na pesa is na pesa ah i used to <laughs> i used to buy skin care products zingine hata ni dangerous ndio umesema allergic but hujui uh-huh. na just sasa umezoea ak ni mpaka unadhani ni part of kumbe una react nilibuy ma black soap nikabuy sijui lemon cleanser hizi ziko best ladies zina kanga legit but no offense yeah, yeah, yeah. and then i used to do so much makeup mm-hmm. siko na ka bila makeup by the way true niko na shindana na makeup before twende sapa na na nafanya na after nush okay. yani okay, yeah. people <laughs> watu wako wako wananiona bila makeup na siko na care juu mnanishwa na kaa vibaya na mnisaidi so let me do something that na feel better about myself but i think pia god anaonanga effort yenye mtu na make like hiyo ku akiona vile unashindanga ume try ana bring sasa more people in your life when you're not direct so hapo ndio nikakutana na nurse akanifunza kuhusu makeup pia mimi nikaanza ku google bana 
Unajua ukikalia shida yako pia haitwa <laughs> <laughs> kusaidia so <laughs> eh nika nikaangalia nika angalia so nikajua the right make up products pia make up ina cause acne yeah juu ni make up maybe mbaya and then wewe hauna uso like so I, I, that so i have yeah. to work you have to put in the work mm-hmm. but pia don't dwell on what people say you especially the kind of society eh yeah. juu some mm-hmm. people will just talk Mm-hmm. And then tena saizi they look at my makeup wako eh una kama mrembo and they are the same people mm-hmm. that walikuwa wananiambia ati eh hey, msichana tajui kupaka so mingi. eh so iko hivyo tu so wewe tu ji 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 saidi and say mm-hmm. hey, life wataongea either way so kikwa mzuri kifanya okay, vizuri eh, kifanya vibaya kikaa vibaya umenona umekon even weight i used to struggle with weight yeah Ni, up to today spend the weight yangu na feeling mnene i think ni ndio mnene fanya kana feel sexy na sasa yuma the ass kitambo ay 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 i used to be at a sign vile mnaniambia anga by the i hope mnasema ukweli tunawaamini no can't lie i told you don't lie eh kinawaamini yani hiyo ndio nimeshikilia hivi na mimi siona i don't know what sijai on your side yako like your way i told you previously eh, eh. nimekuwa in another meeting eh. and someone alikuwa anauliza at what should i answer ama ni nikikuwa ni na hizo fears za what people will think about me and then kuna one lady mwenye alikuwa na wisdom shout eh. out to you eh. if you are watching this video okay unaona like the way you you say um Wait, wait yeah cause you know you know the moment you start thinking like that mm. that means you are transferring the same negative energy to me unknowingly that mm-hmm. means you are surrounding mm-hmm. peer that's mm-hmm. what they are thinking mm-hmm. about so, but okijiwazi okay, a positivity yeah. which is true yeah so people but, will end up hey, thinking but sick wa hapo and then i was mm-hmm. fat me i nilikuwa na jona nimeona ni watu nilikuwa mkonde before Mm-hmm. Nasiku appreciate yo mwingi hata sijui sibili sahau mm-hmm. ilianza kunona form 3 mm-hmm. then sasa ni ile yenye no offense but my own family yeah. even mm-hmm. wanashindwa akikwambia na umenona mm-hmm. unajua if your own mama or your own dad they wanakupea hizo comments na we ni dem already una feeling umenona yeah, dia yeah. chest mm-hmm. cheeks and then msia anakuja anakwambia eh na umenona mm-hmm. unajua konda konda kidogo eh hey, you in a slab sijui kama menotis mimi siwaambia ngi nyinyi mmenona i really yeah. na mwingine akisema ndio na ndio na jaribu ingi nachukia hata hata anakwanga zile za ukitaka kuambia mtu amenona anakwambia ah azine like juu na imagine mimi vile na feel ati umenona unajua hey like sasa nikijangalia hivi kwa kioma kwa bafu na feel mm-hmm. tu na nyama hata aziko yeah, but na feel yeah. nene nikivaa nguo si feel mrembo na nanga bila una overthinking ukivaa brown na feel ime ime <laughs> marieta na feel nyenyezi <laughs> efika hapa na mo ukivaa longi kama si ulikuwa una feel ni kama watu wanaku wanaku judge behind like kuna so hey mimi sijui hizo comments <laughs> communication skills you talk about my By the way I'm a very talkative person. Moment. <laughs> so yeah. This guy can attest. Yeah. But kasi ja kuzoea mm. I'm usually na trying exactly. kujifine, you yeah. know. But kuna hao watu wenye one au huwa hawanielewi. So wananiona nga nikiwa na hawa niko very active. Nikiwa kwingine niko sawa kwa zile najifanya. By the way mimi nilikuwa na lao. Eh nimesaidia. <laughs> Wow, ashinda. Anya. Serena. Let me sit na niko na swali. Like unajua ukisema kwa Allah, of course tunabianga wase. Usi allow those comments. I know. But ndio hii maskio. Niko wazi. Ndio hii ro. Ndio hii macho. Ndio hii mafu. Yaani uwezi fanya hivi. Like 
kwa law ina maanisha nini i think it means mm-hmm. let me let me give this example eh yeah. same kama gospel artist isn't mm-hmm. it yeah mm-hmm. and someone who's deep in salvation and they have their founders mm-hmm. i don't know if it is right to mention mm-hmm. yes yeah. like yeah, like if you know someone who is as in someone is saved and they have their founders they say it's gospel it's gospel. Same yeah. Yeah. no no yeah. let's say like mercy yeah. 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 and yeah. yeah. if if there is a a mini a club somewhere ama a function somewhere where they want to so an artist to perform mm-hmm. for them like mm-hmm. and, you know, secular music and everything mm-hmm. na wanajua nini ya masi stand ya masi mm-hmm. hawezi hata dare kumuita mm-hmm. na hata wakimuita wakijaribu kumuita mm-hmm. masi will ask what what's the function about what am i supposed to sing akiambua you you're supposed to sing such and such a song and then masi comes and evaluates and says this is against my values mm-hmm then she won't go she will decline and say stay sit and mm-hmm. that is the same thing so uh you you've gained weight sindio mm-hmm. and then you you have you've already appreciated your weight mm-hmm. you get we have accepted the boy sija sija ndio menona eh ama hata tuseme auju menona ama no not not really kujua cuz obviously you always know yeah yani ni sawa eh ama tuseme tu uko na acne unajua nga uko na sije all eh pa inafa inafa ile yenye una, una, una you working at it so if i come and tell you hey you have a very bad skin nini nini nitachuja nitasema yes i have a bad skin i know that mm-hmm. one i know mm-hmm. the same way atasema yes i'm a musician mm-hmm. na get ya yeah. so yes niko na hiyo bad skin but kama mtu ajanipea hiyo solution nita stick to hii yangu niseme yes niko na hiyo skin na get mm-hmm. but i am finding ways to be better mm-hmm. so as much as niko na bad skin already as in unajua you already know me and accept eh umeja accept vile huko mm-hmm. and then what are you doing about it mm-hmm. so that way if i come and tell marieta ati oh migu yako sijui na kaaje na get wewe ushaji kubali simbia yeah. eh yeah. and if it is especially if it is something you can't change yeah. Yeah. if it is something you can change then we will not choose as much as people will say bad comments kama mimi vile watu wangeniambia uso yako sijui na kaaje mm-hmm. unachukua alafu there is something one of our friends like say mm-hmm. well, however you interpret this information is up to you mm-hmm. it is entirely up to you mm-hmm. yeah. mm-hmm. he Yeah, no, 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 this one. There is a, there was a mastermind. Oh, oh, oh. Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. The one that does that. Oh, <laughs> one of our friends. Yeah. And I love that. Yeah. I love, I love that about him. He says, yeah. whatever you do with this information is entirely up to you. So that is the same thing with our self-esteem. Mm-hmm. So if my skin is bad and Mercy comes and tells me, Mercy is in a car, I'm going to tell you, Mercy is in a car, I'm going to tell you, your skin is really bad. So whatever I do without information is entirely up to me because yeah. basically she has a funga mask for ya. So is a comment sikuje. Then what am I doing about it? Nitaichukua nianze kulia, nianze kupaka makeup which is not the solution. So no na must use to apply makeup the afunike. But anaongeza because Johnny ajui skin care at ajui kutoa hiyo makeup and alama hivyo anaongeza Okay. Yeah. So, no, no. Mm-hmm. so what are you doing about it? I will get that information kama venye Masi ali transform better. Yeah. I'll get that information anaenda na Google anaenda na uliza hivi hivi hivi. Sasa hii sienda tuna consult kuhusu skin. Eh. No na so yeah. take the statement whatever you do with the information that comes to your ears is yeah. entirely up to you. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So if you want to to to, to have that nice self esteem and a healthy one as I said Mm-hmm. healthy self esteem in effect it comes from within the voices yeah. will come from everywhere yeah. but what have you chosen to do with those voices have you chosen to shut them mm-hmm. which is sometimes is not a good thing to shut them yeah. because And you might we not saw... know you <coughs> might not know that your skin is bad you might not know that you gained weight no yeah, yeah. so nikiambua ni me gain weight what can i do to to to, to change, change or make it i can i can look at my diet mm-hmm. Nini ili cause to that if it nifike hapo nini ilifanya skin yangu itakuwa mbaya mm-hmm. I am not washing my face I am not doing skin care and everything I am not eating well I am not working out mm-hmm. no so when you find the problem then you find the solution mm-hmm. so just the statement what you do with this information is entirely up to you that one will help the voices that come to you because you can't avoid them they will always come mm-hmm. yeah hey. madam <laughs> 
mimi hata siwauzi si mimi nishapanda siwape hadi have grown i know hata si ndo the video i hope you guys are encouraged yeah true damn let me mm. let me te- let me let me tell you yeah. you know when i when, when i said i used to allow mm-hmm. um people to demean me people to make me feel like i'm not worthy like maria you're not beautiful mm-hmm. um <laughs> whatever you choose to do with anything so, that someone says yeah. is entirely up yeah. to you mm-hmm. see mimi nilikuwa ule mtoto wa you know like my par- my parents hawakuwa mm-hmm. wale watu wenye i can go ni waambie like what at the time yeah. mm. so my siblings walikuwa hivyo so i okay like they are nice i but, really appreciate them mm-hmm. but at that moment they they were not the kind of people that i needed okay. hey, i could talk to i could go like mm. air my grievances <coughs> yes if that's the correct english yeah. hey na ilikuwa ina ni affect yeah, I love now yeah. one thing with me I used to seclude myself like me you tell me anything mm-hmm. negative I would seclude myself that friendship in the mm-hmm. end of it can you could block me get block hey ni me west ni me west energy but it's okay we <laughs> we are learning yes yeah, so ah Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Have you ever at any point in your life doubted uh, your personal competence? Yes. You have. Yes. In high school. Unajua nilikuwa primary nilikuwa kwa public school. Ah. Nilianza na private. And you know private. Okay, sijui kama it's a thing but private school students are very bright. Mhm. I don't know why. Okay, content. Nilikuwa inafunzwa it was very difficult. Yeah. Then nikapele kwa a certain local school mm-hmm. after election, post election violence. Mm-hmm. Sasa in that school, mm-hmm. si mimi ni bright nimetoka private. So mm-hmm. nikienda kwa watoto wa public, mimi ni number 1. Yeah. Like exams nilikuwa anga sipata naona mbona tunafanya. Mm-hmm. It was so easy. Nilikuwa nimezoea vitu mm-hmm. So I had that choppy mentality like mm-hmm. nilikuwa najua I'm competent my communication skills yeah. are good. So nikaitwa national Moja. Ndenda, ndenda high school. Nikaela Limuru girls. Who do English Maria said na. Yaani watu unaweza uko unajua nimesomea kwa wakipsigis shout out yeah. to all kalez your mm. accent is the bomb Aha, so nimesomea kwa wakale hadi yeah. my words are kalale kale nilikuwa wale watu why are you kujaring like kwenda ring like ni family kwanga hivyo okay feel so 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 nilifika high school uh-huh. watu wako uh, i went to an expert school uh, <laughs> an expert kwa yani nilikuwa na feel small lakini nilikuwa na feelingi like mwenye aliniona primary na akaniona high school i was a different person yeah. ju watu kwa nilikuwa from rich families kwa shule yangu kulikuwa na kubeba snacks mm-hmm. hadi noodles crips sijui anakuandikia 600 grams blue band stroke peanut stroke jam mm-hmm. kwenu at the time hata mtumia ha, so wewe ndo utanunulua upeleke <laughs> Sukari, ulete koko or coffee or tea bags. Mm-hmm. Nakumbuka when I saw the shopping list I was excited. Sikufikiria the the actual grow. Unajua ukiona unadhani mzazi atakubai everything. Mm-hmm. I remember my dad the uniform peke. Unajua ni zile shule zenye uniform unaendea kwa duka specific si za kujishonea hizi mashule za huko Nairobi mnatumwa mm-hmm. kwa duka yao so every i remember my dad alikujanga usiku ameleta vitu na bags akaniambia kimshana yangu hizi vitu tu nimeleta hivi zimeni cost kitu akaniambia sijui how many thousands akaniambia kienda usome ili niua sasa otu baba yani aki usiku na kofia sasa ha ameleta swimming costume track suit unajua list mm. sasa nakumbuka hata uki, ukiona hizi vitu za noodles nini hata mzazi akikupea tu 1 kg 
akupe tu sachet ya blue band unajua una accept juu unaona ki ametumia vitu mingi mm-hmm. unasahau huko nje wewe wa watu ana huruma watoto creeps mm-hmm. kuna mtu alikuanga na suitcase ya food mm-hmm. na suitcase ya clothes suitcase mimi niliona suitcase mara ya kwanza high school sisi tulikuwa tu wow. box mm-hmm. ile chebo mabati <laughs> so, <laughs> Woi, aki unafika hivi shule. Mm-hmm. Ma desk yetu wangu. Like kila time as you are flavored. Unaona hizi times za breaks, wana toys na zaza strawberry. Mm-hmm. Wewe hauna anything. Wewe unategemea ile chai ya shule yenye mm-hmm. napeana. Mm-hmm. Aya, blue band wako naye. Wewe unategemea. Unaona kile ames tu mm-hmm. tunawekewa hapo promo. Yeah. Hiyo low quality. Mm-hmm. So academics zangu honestly zili flop. Ju sasa nina meet watoto. The first exam nilikuwa namba Like unajua ile mko 300 students mm-hmm. yuko number 150 like when average. Mm-hmm. So nikajiambia by the way ni hivyo. Like siwezi anza kutoka 150 niende 10 mm-hmm. to back. So nilikwanga nachezea hapo 150 130. So sikuwa na feel the brightest. Like nilikuwa na feel mjinga. Nita nilikuwa nasikia watu wakisema hata kaa najua kabisa wako raw. <laughs> Unaona tu uko. Unaona Eh so so ni ni lead out competence yangu. I think sasa campus ndio imefanya nianze ku feel. Eh juu kwa watu wanaku eh wanakuambia eh si na una imba vizuri si na uko. Paka unaona eh na unajua hawa ndio watu wa society. Najua hawa hii ndio society si high school. So unaanza ku feel. Mse hata home watu wako wanaambia ati naimba vizuri literally watu waaminiki nikisema hivyo nyinyi ndio actually mnani panga si fani fanya tendi clearly haimbi vizuri clearly yeah alafu pia kuna hii kitu iko campus like kuna students wenye they always shut you down kwa masomo like Uh, unajua as a teacher mimi ni mwalimu tunafunzwa if i ask a question yeah. wewe unipe answer mm-hmm. nafaa kusema that's good mm-hmm. and then niseme in addition to that sasa mm-hmm. niseme kitu different ufai kujibu mm-hmm. alafu ni nianze kujibu like after memaliza hata mimi na na usually zinafanana so what am i trying to show you wewe well, you are competent less <laughs> unaona sasa like kuna wasetu they always shut you down sana sana juu tuko campus kuna wasetu wana feeling they know everything so unakuta ume suggest kitu maybe kwa medicine mtu anakupinga kabisa but ana copy paste ni vile tu ametumia different terms kama sasa zimembe na gastrex kwa so you <laughs> You are embarrassing yes. us. Yeah, finish. The medical field. No, 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 I find any feeling competent. So no. <laughs> Have you ever doubted? <laughs> yes, several have doubted. Especially in academics.